Greetings, I'm Professor Hobo. Today is the big day you've all been waiting for. It's the official release of the Jackery Explorer 1000 Portable Power Station. And in today's video, we're gonna show you how it charges with solar. Yes, today is the day you can finally purchase the coveted Jackery Explorer 1000 on Amazon for only $7.99, but that's gonna be only with the promo code I'm gonna give you later in this video. First, I promised you guys in my last video about the Explorer 1000, I was gonna show you how to hook it up with two solar panels to charge it from solar. We're gonna give you some real world numbers of how long this thing actually is gonna take if you charge it with 200 watts of solar. Let's do it. And here we have it. We have the two Solar Saga 100 solar panels in parallel charging the Jackery Explorer 1000. Let's see what kind of wattage we're getting right now. You guys can see that it says 120. Now, just a minute ago, before I turned the camera on, I was getting 130. So let's try repositioning the panels and see if we can do a little better. I moved the solar panels a little bit. Didn't really seem to change too much. We're still doing about 122, 123 watts. So what are we getting off of one panel right now? 81 watts. Let's see what happens if we plug one panel into the Anderson and one panel into the eight millimeter because I've had a bunch of you ask me if that's possible. Let's show you. Let's see what happens when we plug in the eight millimeter connector which has the other solar panel hooked up to it. No change at all. Actually, you see it just turned to zero for a second and now the watt is actually less. The reasoning for this is this takes priority between these two connections. If you have something plugged into both, only this one is going to send power to the Jackery. And I'll prove that to you by unplugging the Anderson and you should see no change. It's still doing about 50, 51 watts, which is what it was doing when we plugged the other panel in. You can't use both inputs at the same time and charge from both ports at the same time. You can plug something into both ports and it will just favor whatever's plugged into the eight millimeter. You'll see it went to zero and now it's switching over to the other panel, which for some reason the other panel is doing 75 watts. So anybody who tells you otherwise that you can use both these inputs at the same time and charge from both at the same time is fibbing you, because we show you right here on Hobotech, that is not the case. So here we go, both panels are plugged in, we're getting around 120 watts, it's bouncing between 118 and 120. So we call that typical charging for a typical day. It's about 1.30 in the afternoon. This is what sky conditions look like. It's still a little bit hazy, but it is cloudless today, so I figured this was the best day to try this test. And the stands for the solar panels are non-adjustable, so you either need to lay them flat on the ground or have them angled at their 45 degree setting for the legs. So if the sun is in between, you just got to deal with it. I did lay them flat. It actually got worse uh, power wise. So we're going to go ahead and use our ratings of about 120 watts to estimate how long it would take to charge the Jackery Explorer 1000. So your next question is going to be, how did you actually hook these up in parallel when Jackery has not released a parallel cable yet? Well, I hobbled this together from basically different adapters that I had. I just cut some wires and I taped them together to make a temporary parallel cable. So all you're doing is you're hooking the red to red and black to black on each panel. You'll see I have a cable running down here. So red to red, black to black on Anderson. And you're just hooking them all together. So you see red to red, black to black. This cable goes all the way down to this junction, which is where uh, all three cables are taped together. So we got this other cable here going to this other Jackery panel, red to red, black to black. And if you want a closer look at this cable, this is what it looks like. I just, like I said, I kind of just pieced this together. You're just hooking the two panels together, red to red, black to black, that simple. For that test, I had to create the parallel cable to hook two Solar Saga 100 solar panels in parallel with the Jackery. Now you can't hook two solar panels in series with this because it does unfortunately have a 30 volt maximum limit. Most solar panels, in case you don't know, are actually 18 volt panels. They, they call them 12 volts, 
but they typically run 18 to 20 volts. And if you put two of them in series, it's generally 40 volts. Well, this can only handle 30 volts. So you can put one panel on it and take forever to charge it, or you can put two panels on it in parallel, which basically doubles the amps, but keeps the voltage around 20 volts. So you can charge this with 200 watts of solar in parallel, but you actually need to use a special cable. Now, unfortunately, because of that silly virus that's been running around the whole world, uh, there are supply issues. The Jackery tells me they're gonna have their parallel cable coming in in the next week, and they're gonna send them to anybody who purchases the Explorer 1000. But I couldn't even get my hands on one, so I had to make my own out of basically spare Anderson connectors I had laying around. I just chopped them up in order to do this demonstration. So as you can see from the results of the test, we had two of these in parallel with the Jackery Explorer 1000, and we're able to charge on a typical day here in Arizona at about 120 watts. Now, if you do the math, that means you can charge this from completely dead to completely full with two solar panels in just over eight hours, about eight and a quarter hours. That means pretty much most of the year around, you should be able to charge this with two solar panels from dead. Now, of course, the key is you buy something bigger than what you need. And in this case, this has a 1,002 watt hour battery. Only draw it down as much as you need to, then charge it up with solar every day. Most people aren't going to completely deplete this thing 1,000 watt hours every single day. You might deplete it halfway or even three quarters. And in that case, you deplete it halfway, it'll only take four hours to charge from solar. If you deplete it three quarters of the way, it's gonna be six hours from solar. Those are much more reasonable numbers to get in one day, especially in the winter time when a lot of parts of the United States only gets about eight hours, six to eight hours of good sun. Now, Jackery did tell me that customer service is going to send out the adapter cable, the official Jackery cable, not this piece of crap. They're gonna send everybody who buys one of these or buys the upcoming bundle I'm gonna talk about, they're gonna get the parallel cable for free, so don't worry about it. They'll actually contact you through email. Today, March 18th, 2020, is the official release date of the Explorer 1000. It is also what Jackery is calling Jackery Day, which means every year on this day, they're gonna release a new product to the public. The Explorer 1000 is launching in both the United States and Canada at the same time, which means the Explorer 1000 is available right now on Amazon Canada for $13.99 Canadian dollars. Canadians, go to the description below. There's a link down there to send you right to where you need to go. Also today is the brand new Jackery store launch. Now what Jackery is doing is they're trying to move some of their business to their website and buy directly from Jackery. They will have their own incentive and promotions over there on the Jackery store. The same Hobo Tech codes I'm about to give you work both on Amazon and on the Jackery store. And I am an affiliate with Jackery, so if you do buy the products from the Jackery store, I will actually get a small commission for it. Now for the discount codes I know you've all been waiting for. For the Jackery Explorer 1000, you get $200 off if you use Hobotech 1000. That's all one word. It doesn't matter if you use uppercase or lowercase. Hobotech 1000. Put that in either at the Jackery store or put that in Amazon during checkout in the promo code section and you'll get $200 off. That means the final price will be $7.99. Doesn't matter where you buy it. Now there's also a bundle deal with the Jackery Explorer 1000 and two 100 watt solar saga panels. Now, I'll explain how you get this bundle deal. You add two of these panels, two of the 100 watt solar saga panels, which the link is below, and add the Jackery Explorer 1000 to your shopping cart. All three of these need to be in your cart. Then you use code HOBOTECH3 to get $300 off of this combo. Now you'll be able to charge with either solar panel immediately, but you will have to wait for that adapter in the mail before you can connect both of these in parallel to the Jackery Explorer 1000. So remember, we're gonna add all three of these products to your cart before using Hubbo Tech 3, or it's gonna tell you that code doesn't work. So make sure all three are in your cart first. And as for the Jackery store, you don't need any kind of stinking codes or anything like that you'll instantly get $300 off at the Jackery store just by choosing the bundle that includes the Explorer 1000 and the two solar panels. So I'm gonna have a link below to both the Amazon page for adding these three products if you wanna buy through Amazon, or if you wanna go to the Jackery store, I'll include a link for that too. You can go right there, it's one item you add to your cart, 
the discount's immediate. You get it for $12.99. That's $12.99 for the Explorer 1000 plus two Jackery Solar Saga panels. And these things typically go for about $300 each on their own. So it is a pretty good deal. And if you want to see the review I did on the Solar Saga 100, I'll also link that in the end of this video. Maybe I'll even put it down in the description. So you guys can see what kind of quality panels these things really are. This is actually, and I've reviewed a lot of solar panels, this is actually my favorite portable panel out there. Now I do have some other news by Jackery, and it's something I completely disagree with, but they're doing their own thing. I don't run their company. I am not employed by them. I am just a messenger, basically. Uh, Jackery is no longer offering promotional codes for the Explorer 160, 240, or 290 because they're going to be posted at a special low price for the entire year of 2020. Um, the promo codes for the Jackery solar panels are still going to work just fine, and the codes for the Explorer 500 and the Explorer 1000 will all work as well. This only affects the Explorer 160, the 240, and the Honda 290. Those codes I have on my website, I'm going to go ahead and remove. I'm going to go ahead and remove those links from all future videos. But if you go back and watch my old videos, those links are still going to be there. Just be aware, those promotional codes are no longer going to work as of today. Now, if you're interested in the Explorer 1000 or the solar panels or both, or even any of the other Jackery products, the links below for everything is down in the description of this video. So just go down to the description, click on more info. You'll see all the links down there for everything. You can also go to hobotech.tv slash Amazon. Scroll down to Jackery. I have an entire section dedicated to Jackery products and the special promotion codes. That's it for now. Thanks for watching. If you learned something today, don't forget to give me a thumbs up below. And if you're not a subscriber already, you know what to do. That's it for now. Till next time. Odin commands you to like and subscribe and clean my litter box. For the solar test, it requires hooking up two 100 watt Jackery solar saga panels in parallel. <coughs> <coughs> oh, I don't have coronavirus. My throat's just dry. Not bad. Hey, thank you for watching our video. If you liked it, be sure to subscribe, share, and like. And we'll see you guys next time. Say hi, Odin. Barbie Gold Gun Hat.